right, everybody, why have one dog at Local on Two if you can have two? That's right, we've got two beautiful dogs right here. Camp Bow Wow has moved to an all new location after 15 years, and it's perfect for doggos just like these just, babies. Just like these, but black is not so perfect for two golden. <laughs> we are joined by Steve and Leon. First of all, tell us about these beautiful babies. Well, this is Chloe and this is Indy. It's one of our best clients, dogs, and uh, we thought they'd be great for television. So. <laughs> <laughs> over here. I love it. Okay, so as I mentioned, you guys have been around for 15 years. Yes. You just moved to a new location. Yes. So tell us what Camp Bow Wow is and why it is so helpful for doggy parents. Uh, we're an all-day daycare and dog boarding facility, and it's great for dog parents because we wear their dogs out. <laughs> we, get them, we get this energy out, and it's great for the dogs because dogs are social animals, and they need to be with other dogs. So that's why we did it. It's so true. And I know that you guys wanted to create a Disneyland for yeah, dogs with yeah. your new facility, but you guys also have some really cool upgrades. So talk about the new facility and all the bells and whistles. Yeah, it's much larger. Um, it also has, um, we've doubled the amount of cabins, so hopefully get away from the uh, long wait list that we have all, every weekend and holidays. So that was part of the goal. Um, we've also added a very sophisticated air filtration system to combat uh, canine respiratory illnesses, right. which is unfortunately going on in the country right yeah. now. And then we also sterilize, we've got a commercial washer that uh, sterilizes the bowls, uh, so superheats the water. So we, we've gone a long way to try to make everything as, as sophisticated and as good as we can for the dogs. That's Very amazing. Good. That's good because it's important. You've got dogs, you've got germs, you want your baby to feel, yeah. you know, to be clean and safe. <laughs> yeah. um, and everybody knows CPR, doggy CPR. Yes, I like that. they did. All of our staff are trained in pet CPR. That's yeah. great. Okay. Yeah. Very cool. Now, Leanne, you also work for the Humane Society of the United States. Awesome. We love right. our rescue babies yes. around here. Yes. Tell me a little bit about the mission behind that. Um, the Humane Society of the United States is a national organization. It is separate from your local humane societies. Mm -hmm. um, we kind of take on the big fights that your local humane organizations can't take on. The, I mean, I know in Tennessee we've responded to numerous large animal seizures, like law enforcement actions, puppy mills, dog fighting, cock fighting, all kinds of things like that. Um, and we do that all across the country. We have a fantastic animal rescue team. And as a matter of fact, uh, Steve is donating all of the kennels from the old Camp Bow Wow to the HSUS animal rescue team so that they can assist law enforcement on cruelty cases oh, yes. all across the country. We lost the dog. We lost the dog. Down one. Okay, we got it. Her mom's over there, so yeah, there she goes. That's amazing. So, yeah, so we're, we're donating um, that and we are, uh, my job is the director of animal cruelty policy. So I specifically work on legislation to address cruelty, neglect, animal fighting, things like that. Thank you. Thank you. And um, I worked as the Tennessee State Director for eight years and then moved into a position as uh, uh, working nationally with all of our state directors across the country. Um, so, yeah, so we work on legislation to protect animals. What can, yeah. we, what can we as a community mm -hmm. do just to kind of show up and make sure that this, we eradicate yeah. all of this? Well, and that, that's it, is showing up. Um, you know, legislators, no matter what state it is, legislators have a lot on their plate, right? They have a lot of, um, a lot of issues to address. It, it, everything from child abuse to animal abuse to roads and schools and everything mm -hmm. else, they just need to know what's important to you. They need mm -hmm. to know that these animals are important. They're part, part of our family. We care about their well-being. We, you know, um, we actually just worked, uh, the state, Tennessee State Director and I worked on a bill with Senator L uh, John Lumberg to protect Tennessee animals who are outside in harsh weather. Mm -hmm. So just things as simple as defining what a doghouse is or a shelter for dogs who mm -hmm. live outdoors and having the public get behind that and understand how important it is to protect all of our animals. I love you. <laughs> thank you so much. It is a hard road. It is. A really hard yeah. road, so thank you for yeah. fighting the good fight. Let's thank keep you. it going. Yes. All right. Thank you, guys. Thank you. All right, treat your furry friends to the absolute best. Check out CampBowWow.com and click on Downtown Nashville. This Local on 2 weather